Brickell, September 19, 2017. 131 p.m. Precious Metals Miner Buenaventura is considering bidding for the $2 billion Machicuale Copper Project in Peru which the South American nation is auctioning off in November. Speaking at the Paramount Industry Convention in Arequipa Buenaventura Chairman Roque Benavidos told Reuters the company has already bought the necessary bidding paperwork adding that Buenaventura could develop Machicuale by sharing infrastructure with two other proposed mines in the northern region of Cajamarca Conga, owned by Buenaventura and Newmont Mining, and the China Min Metals Copper Gold Project Galeno. Buenaventura produced 127,000 tons of copper last year, mostly through its 20% stake in Freeport McMoran's 500,000 tons per year Cerro Verde mine in the country. According to Benavides, the Yanacacha mine, another Newmont Buenaventura joint venture, is seeking to produce more copper as its gold production diminishes. In its 2011 annual report Anglo envisaged a 187,000 tons per year operation at Machicuale with expansion potential to 300,000 tons copper per year A contract for Machicuale will be awarded on November 15 by Pure State Bidding Agency Prinversion. According to Prinversion, mineral resources at Machicuale are estimated at 1.1 billion tons of copper with an average grade of 0.629% and a cutoff of 0.4% copper. The asset also holds gold, silver and molybdenum. Anglo-American Lionel acquired the rights to Machicuale in 2007 for $400 million, but the mining giant pulled out of the project in December 2014. In its 2011 annual report Anglo envisaged a 187,000 tons per year operation at Machicuale with expansion potential to 300,000 tons copper per year. Anglo announced in April this year it's bringing forward construction plans for its Guelaveco copper project in the country which is set to produce an average of 220,000 tons per year starting as early as 2020. Milpo, controlled by Brazil's Votorantum Metals, later evaluated the project. But the miner withdrew from Machicuale in March this year after Prinversion asked Milpo to modify its proposal for the mine's development. At the time, the company said the proposed changes were not compatible with market conditions. Peruvian production to Spike Newmont halted construction work at Conga in November 2011 after violent protests against the $4.8 billion project forced the country's government to declare a state of emergency. Conga could be a 500,000 ton plus operation, while production at Galeno, which comes with a $2.5 billion price tag, is pegged at more than 400,000 tons per year. Earliest date for production at Galeno is 2021. A recent study counted 18 major new and growth copper projects in Peru including expansion at Southern Copper's Taquipala and Chinalco's Toromacho mines. Already the world's number two producer of the metal, the country's national output, is expected to hit 4.8 million tons per year by 2021, more than double the 2.3 million tons produced last year. Copper futures edged up in Tuesday trading in New York with December contracts exchanging hands for $2.97 a pound, up 18% in value in 2017. Copper hit an intraday level just shy of $3.18 a pound more than $7,000 a ton during the first week of September, a near three-year high.